Hey y'all, it's Kristen, and I'm finally back. I know I've been gone for a while, but you know, I said in my last video that I was, you know, I'd been sick, but I was getting better. Well, I jinxed myself because I had a relapse, and so anyway, I'm better now, and I kind of hate to say that <laughs> because I don't want to get sick again, but anyway, hopefully everything is good because I'm going to the beach in a couple weeks, and I do not want to be sick. Anyway, I have some more happy mail, and I am so surprised and so excited about this. This is from Amelia. Hi, Amelia. Um, she just she just sent me something because she loves me. I guess. I mean, I she I don't think, and I need I should have looked this up before I started this video. I don't think she has a YouTube channel. I'm gonna look before I post it, and if she does, I'll link it down below. I don't think she does though. Anyway, this is a little card that she made me. I'm not going to open it up. I've already read it, but I have, I just wanted to show you. I think she made it. It looks like she did. Anyway, it's so cute. So anyway, I'm so excited and surprised. I mean, I really am. And I don't know what else to say. I'm just amazed. So I'm going to open this. I opened the end of the box, but I haven't done anything else. Oh my gosh. And it's heavy. Holy crap. Oh my. Y'all know how I am in these videos. Of course, I've only had a couple of Happy Mail things, but I get kind of sidetracked and then... Oh my. Let me make sure I'm in frame here. Oh my goodness. This is an ephemera kit, and I think these... Well, I've seen these at Tuesday morning. But I love these. And it's so funny, I bought a couple of these, but I don't have this one. Because I wanted this one, I saw it on someone's video, but when I went to, they didn't have this one. So I'm so, I'm so thankful for that. 110 pieces. Huh. This is great. Okay. Oh, and there's little keys in there. Can y'all even see? I'm not even looking to see if y'all can see. Wow, okay. What is this? Not that old. 1983 train conductor logbook. Thought that would be good journals. Heck yeah, they are. Let me take this off. Cool. Oh, and they have different... Let me see. Huh. This is nifty. I like that a lot. I'll definitely use that. It might not even fit in one of those traveler's notebooks. This says, not old, but thought they were different. Okay. What are these? Oh, this is some kind of game, game thing. Look at those. Those are really pretty. Huh. Oh, bridge. Okay. Oh, I love those. Okay, I mean, I'm kind of like, where do I start? What are these? 1925 oil o -matic something. Four winners. What is this? Hang on. Should I know what these are? Are they ads? I mean, magazine pages? You know what I'm saying. Okay, I'm having a hard time. Y'all are just going to have to bear with me. Oh, they are. And I've never had any that are packaged like this with the um, backing stuff. Cool. Look at those. Sturdy legs, stronger ankles. All right. Roller skates. I hope y'all can see this. Huh. That is so awesome. 1929. I love how they package this and put the um the date up here and everything. Cool. March 1930. Amos and Andy. Pepsi Dent ad. Look. That is See, if I, I want to see the other side. One moment, people. It's 
steamship. Oh, these are just wonderful. I'm being careful. Okay, I can tell right now I'm not going to be able. I'm going to look through these on the front. And then if I have time at the end, then I will um, open them all up and look at the backs too. Fading Memories and Fadeless Movies, which we'll bring up. Huh. 1930, 1931, it's a refrigerator ad, General Electric. Am I moving too much? I mean, too fast? These are, oh my gosh, 1945, Met Opera Stars. Look at that. Oh my. 1946, Irene Dunn. Magnavox. That is just nifty. Let me make sure you can see. Okay. This one says, I'm not into trains or anything, but some good ads and the classifieds in the back look great coffee dot. Girl, do you make your... Um, do you make tra uh not travelers? Do you make junk journals? Is what I'm trying to say. I'm kind of thinking you do. If you do, you need to let me know. And I am going to look and make sure. See if you have a uh, YouTube channel. This is really cool. Let's see what the date. 1987. I kind of like trains, just saying. It's pretty pictures. I hope y'all can see I'm just looking and not looking what y'all are looking at. This is a cool magazine. I could even do like a train journal. Somebody, I know people are into all different things. Okay. Oh, how pretty. Did you put that on the front? That is so pretty. Mm -hmm. I've seen these before. Are these at TJ Maxx? Or maybe the ones I saw? Or either that or Tuesday morning? I love this. This would be... Look at that butterfly. These pages will be great in a journal. That is gorgeous right there. Huh. Okay. How adorable. These are um, close pins. Oh, and you know what? I'm working on a journal, and it's got these colors in it. So those are going to be great. Let's see. Something. Girl, I'm having trouble reading your handwriting. I'm sorry. Your handwriting is like mine. I used to have really good handwriting. Then I got old and... Okay, this is not coming off. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay. This tape is really good. What does that say? Something. Something. Buttons are from old wedding dress. Oh my goodness. My guess 1960s. All old materials. Girl. I love this kind of stuff. Oh my. There's some buttons right here. This is so fantastic. These are um buttons with cloth over them. And little applique. Oh my goodness. My dog's trying to get in the door. He's growling at me. I shut him out. Look at these. Oh my. Am I going too slow? Am I boring you? Because, holy crap. Look at these with the different color on the inside. Now, I don't have anything like this. This is amazing. Let me put this down. Did I drop something? Okay, no. Look at this. 
see the thing, the doilies at the top? And then this. Oh my goodness. This is great. Oh my. Wow. I love this. Amelia, you did so good. What in the heck is this? Some kind of yarn. That is cool. All different colors. Yay. I'm definitely using these. I always use just like a cream color. I mean, I think once I use some pink or something. I never think, to, and I've got all kinds, not this. I don't have this stuff. This is cool. I have some uh, crochet, um, not crochet. What am I saying? Cross stitch thread. That's what I use sometimes too in all different colors. And I never think to use it. What is this? Red something are from Germany. Okay. Red what? Oh my. Look at this. You know, okay. I've been thinking about doing charms and stuff on the spines of my journals. Here you go. This is happening. Oh my gosh, look at that. This must these must be from like a chandelier or something. Or maybe some kind of lamp. I'm not sure. These are wonderful. Oh, look at this. This one. Look at that. Yep. I'm doing a thing on the... This by itself would be cool. Wow. Oh, my goodness gracious. I'm sweating again. Let me make some room. Then we got some clothespins, which, you know, this is another thing. And I'm glad that you sent these because I'm like, I see people using stuff. And then you know how you watch so many videos and then you forget about all the wonderful ideas that you saw on YouTube. I saw someone using these. I'm going to use some. Ooh, material. And a book. Okay, I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's look at these, um... Napkins. Ooh. Look at these. Aren't they beautiful? Okay, we have those. Oops, was I even in frame? Oh my gosh, I love these. Those. And I love these. These, see, I'm going to make a Paris journal for my sister. So there you go. This might even be the front. Of course, I think I said that about something else the other day, but still. I love that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Huh. Okay. This is stuffing. Oh, look. Oh, my gosh. Y'all. Look at these flower centers. Can you see them? Those are gorgeous. I saw someone, who was it? I think Paula. Paula Lemon using these in her flowers on the front or something. Huh. These are cute too. You could just clip these right off and use them. These might look good in that journal I was talking about I was working on right now. Oh my goodness. Okay. Wait, how many minutes am I? Oh, Lord. I'm already at 14 minutes. Okay. Here's some fabric, which I am so excited about. I got some more fabric the other day from that same place that I was telling y'all about. This is gorgeous. Huh. Is this a sleeve? I don't know, but it's very beautiful. Can y'all see that? See how it shines? Oh my goodness. Okay. I can't be spending 30 minutes on each thing, even though I want to. Oh, this is pretty too. I love this color. 
Ooh, this is cool. That's like stitched, raised stitching right there and there. Wow. And that's a big piece of that too. That's going to look really cool. I had to make some pockets with that. Ooh. Where did you find this stuff? That's what I want to know. Man. Ooh. Okay, this can, I think this might go in this, that journal I'm talking about too. It's got green in it. That's gorgeous. It's a big piece of that. Oh, look at the other side. Huh. It's reversible. Okay. That is lovely. Amelia, I'm just beside myself. This is so much. Look at this. I keep trying, every time I pick something up, I'm like, ooh, under it. Okay, don't do that. Florence Nightingale. This book is not that old, but has some good pictures and pages. Okay. Yes, it does. Cool. You can make journal cards out of each one of these. Just back them. Yep. Oh, and this book smells good, too. What's the date? 1969. I love this. Whew, I love old books. Okay. You and I don't like to tear old books. These pages are from 1962 Reader's Digest that um, were already torn apart, thought they're good for coffee, dyeing, and pockets. You're exactly right. I know that I make junk journals, which doesn't make a lick of sense, that I don't like to tear up books, but I am a book lover, which is a total contradiction. I love these pages. Wow. So this is just fabulous because, ooh. See, I never find Reader's Digest with cool book, uh, book pages like this. You have to tell me what year this was. Y'all hear my dog in there? That's my golden retriever, not my which I'm sure y'all can figure that out by the bark. Of course he's barking. Those are cool. I, what did I, did I miss something? Old scrap, oh, this is old scrapbook pages. Okay, leave that there. These are cards to cut apart. Oh man. Y'all, I'm serious, I'm sweating. I do this every time. Envelope and card, look at that. That's beautiful. Painted bunting. Oh, where in the world did you find these? Happy birthday. I love this purple. And also, girl, I'm doing a purple journal. Um, using uh, a digital kit by... Um, that is too cute right there. Look at that. Um, Ephemera's Vintage Garden. Her purple ring... I got it not too long ago. Look at the envelope. What was the envelope? Oh, look at the envelope. I'm missing. Look at these. And morning glories. Oops. There's the envelope for that one. Oh no, this is a, a page. Cool. Does that go? That kind of looks like that, but not. Oh, the envelope. Okay, there you go. You just fold it up. Look at that. Mary's Flower Hut. Oh my gosh, seriously? I'm sorry for the barking. There's the envelope. I love that. 
please, if my phone cuts out, y'all, because I'm not, what is it, 20 minutes? Because I'm not paying attention, I'll just do, a, I'll just start a part two. Look at these. That one was pretty too. I'm, I'm trying to not have to do a part two. These are gorgeous. Ooh, look at this. I love that. Can y'all see that? Isn't that amazing? Oh, look at that envelope with the bees. Okay, my dogs, my husband's outside and they're barking at him. That's what it is. I love this envelope. I don't know if I can use that. That is too pretty. Oh, and this one, look at that. I'd read you what the front says, but I don't have my glasses on. But it's a birthday card. Oh, man. Okay. Those are really cool. You're going to tell me where you got that, too. Are you writing down my questions, girl? Okay. These are old scrapbook pages. They're out of an old scrapbook. These are amazing. They have a little bit of staining around the edges. Huh. Okay. Those will definitely be used. For sure. I was told 1930s for this. Okay. Okay. I thought my phone just clicked off. This is a cool bag. Oh my. Oh my gosh. I love these. Look at this. These are the cards. These are postcards. And they're embossed. Oh, these are fabulous. See, this is the kind of thing that I'm like, can I put these in my journals? This one's an Easter one. I really hope I've been in frame, because again, I haven't been looking. This is another Easter one. Look at that. I have a stamp that looks kind of like that. And I forgot about it till just now, looking at that. Oh, these are great. Whew. Oh my gosh. So you go putting stuff like this in your journals and you're like, I just want to keep it for myself. Paper from Italy. Really? Wow. How do you part with this stuff? That's what I want to know. When I was getting Gail's thing together, I was like, oh, mm -mm. I was try I had to give her some stuff because I love her. But I was... I kept going, do I want to give her this? Do I really want to? I did. I gave her some cards. You know, the ones that I had that were kind of like this, that were embossed. They were really old. Mine were like from 1910 or something like that. I gave her one because that's how much I love her. This paper is gorgeous, by the way. Whew. I mean, really pretty. I wonder if I'm scared to coffee diet. I probably won't. I'll probably just put it in a journal. Okay. I was told the music from 1920s. The ads are from 1944 Parents Magazine. What is this? And how in the world do I open it? Okay. Y'all, I feel like my phone's just fixing to go bloop. Okay, what is this first? This is Seven Gypsies paper. Cool. Look at this. Can I hold it down? Okay, hold it down. That is really cool. There's two pieces of it. Ooh, I'm gonna be using that. I never, I don't have any Seven Jitsus paper. I don't know why. I have all everything else. Okay, open. Oh my gosh, okay. Music paper. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Don't throw food away. I thought that said Speedo, like for kids. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, this is awesome. Can y'all see? I hope so. 
Oh my, and see, I'm doing a baby book, so this is going to be amazing. If I can bring myself to cut it up. Oh man. Cold sores, camphophonique. Waffle mix. There you go, X Lax. She's happy. She's not happy. She's not happy. She's happy. <laughs> oh, I guess pooping will do that for you. Oh my gosh, this is great. Santa flush. Oh, there's a baby's butt. Okay. Oh my gosh, that was great. Okay, this, what did you say about this music? It is from what? You said 1920. Seriously? Oh my. Amelia, I cannot tell you. This is just amazing. I'm going to have to get you something together, but girl, you're going to have to give me some. I mean, I know what you like because you like what I like, but still, you might want to give me a few ideas if you've seen stuff that I've shown that you like. Maybe you can help me out. This is awesome. Oh my gosh, and they're big pieces. I love that. Okay, y'all. This is my huge Happy Meal from Amelia. Amelia, thank you so much. I love you, girl. This is so great. Oh my gosh. Okay, I gotta go cool down. Thank you so much for watching.